this video I'm going to talk about the recent work uh, element and um, uh, for this exact uh, demonstration I will just go to the uh, Kalia's demo website because I have some technical problems with my uh, local host uh, installation so if you want to preview the elements simply go to elements and recent work <coughs> sorry so as you can see we have a few styles right here uh, first we have the recent work uh, which is um, the let's say the default one but it's style 2 now styles 2 uh, as you can see it's from version 4 uh, it's quite recent and it's a nice uh, nice um, hover effect with uh, as you can see it has a bit of a stranger layout because it's um, this one sorry uh, this one right here is uh, fixed right uh, right into the alignment of the container while this one is offset until the edge of the uh, window so as you can see uh, we have um, a carousel inside uh, we can show the category and the title and you can link to the portfolio uh, item um, then we have the default style which is uh, the style is actually uh, from the beginning of the uh, Kalias launch um, it has a nice effect of uh, a hover effect uh, the control navigation it's uh, as you can see is placed into a normal uh, 12 column size uh, block and let me just edit this page with a page builder so I'm just going to click on the gear icon which is the settings you can see I can um, the first option is uh, to specify the height of the image now I'm going to make them a bit bigger as you can see the images have uh, increased then we have the uh, style <coughs> um, this is actually I think it did, this is a problem right here because this is style 3 and here is specified style 2 but anyway I'm going to uh, get onto that one too so this one asks to place inside 12 columns now if I take a look it's placed onto a 12 column but the section is uh, marked as full width in size so if I'm making this a fixed width it's still going to work but as you can see it has some small problems so make sure you select uh, full width then let's so moving on um, can change the uh, title of the element the description right here you can ch also change the uh, page link you can add a full link or uh, the uh, actual uh, uh, just uh, slug of the of the page you can change the text in the um, view all button and you can specify what categories should this uh, element uh, display for example you might want just one category just select one category and if you want to for example hold command uh, or control and select as many as many as you want I'm just going to select them all and you can specify the number of portfolio items to load now uh, it's recommended uh, not to load too many because it will affect the performance of the overall uh, page now in case you're wondering where these uh, these uh, 
uh, portfolio items are loaded uh, as you can see I already said about the categories but to give you a better example just go to the dashboard uh, actually the back end of your uh, installation go to portfolio items and you can see here the uh, portfolio items um, created you can add a new one you can add a title specify the category uh, add the, the details there's an entire video about the uh, portfolio and the page builder portfolio so um, just uh, just have a look at that video and we'll explain how to add the portfolio items and uh, categories so this is uh, the uh, recent work uh, element let me just also get to the simple style as you can see style 1 is defined with a height of uh, 190 pixel and the description page link and the categories and number of portfolio items again do not use too many because uh, uh, it will affect the performance of the page so if you have any questions about this element feel free to ask me and if you have uh, troubles with it um, you can subscribe to our support forums and my colleagues will uh, guide you and assist you there so thanks for watching and see you in the next one